Hey Queens! Welcome to my channel. In today's video we are going to be doing this makeup look right here. I went ahead and used the 35S Sweet Oasis palette by Morphe once again to complete this look. Um, if you guys want to see how I went ahead and created today's look, well let's just get into today's video. Alright my queens, so as you see we did one eye off camera and I'm going to go ahead and begin with this eye. Per usual, you know we didn't do the same thing we did last week and the opposite eye. So for this eye look today we're going to be using the 35S Sweet Oasis Morphe palette. Um, I've used this before um, but I used the teals and the blues on this side right here. So today we're going to be using these two rows. Um, the pinky rose right here these ones and uh, yeah this is a pretty pretty beautiful palette that we're gonna use so whew, let me begin and we're gonna apply some concealer today I'm gonna be using the ColourPop no filter concealer I'm just trying to finish up all of my products that I have honestly to kind of revamp or re-up my collection here so yeah all right let's blend this out I feel very very hot today if you guys see me off a little bit today and not in my full weird mode it's because I kind of feel iffy today um, I was diagnosed with vertigo a few years back and I get my flare-ups every now and again and today was one of those days where I had it <clears throat> this morning I took my medication and it wasn't working for me um, so I still kind of feel a little dizzy and I have a headache but I still decided to sit down and film a video with you guys no excuses I needed to get this done anyway so I kind of took advantage that I called off after I started feeling a little bit better, then I sat down and I'm filming. So here we are. All right, uh, I'm gonna go in with this little Luxie mini tapered one to one brush, and I'm gonna go in with Sneak a Kiss from that palette, which is just a little pinky shade. I'll show it to you guys. It's this pinky shade right here. This one. It's called Sneak a Kiss. And I'm just gonna apply this all over my eyelid. Everywhere, just everywhere. This is gonna give us that pink tone, obviously. <laughs> I decided to do this pinky look today because I wanted something, I was gonna be doing something a little bit more dramatic and a blue eyeshadow. But um, I was like, you know what, let me keep it a bit more neutral for my people out there. Um, yeah, because I know some of you guys don't like crazy makeup looks, so... Not that I do anything crazy, it's just, you know, more vibrant colors, I guess. Some people are not comfortable, they haven't broken out of that comfort zone, which it took me a long time to play with color. A very, very, very long time. Alright, now I'm going to go in with the Morphe R38 brush and I'm going in with Sandbar, which is that khaki-ish, brownish color right next to Sneak a Kiss. And we're going to go ahead and apply this to the outer portion and we're just going to smoke it out into our brow bone. I'm just going to go back and forth like I normally would. I'm using a very tiny mirror today and um, it's messing with me because I'm used to having a bigger mirror so I'm using a few mirrors that are in front of me in case you see me wandering elsewhere. <clears throat> also I just ate so if you see me messing around that's why. I'm going back in with Sneak a Kiss and just kind of blending out that brown, making it more pinky like we did previous videos, in previous videos. Yeah. Alright. <clears throat> now I'm going to go in with an SL Miss Glam eyeshadow brush in N15 
and I am going to be grabbing two eyeshadows, two different eyeshadows. I'm going to go in with one side for just two, us two and then champagne one, oh, champagne on ice. I thought that said one on one. Champagne on ice and just us two. Those are the two colors I'm going to be picking up with this brush. Um, so one side I'm going to go in with just us two first and we're going to apply this to the inner portion of my Can you shut up? I'm being so rude, huh? I apologize. But I don't know what color I was using. Or what side I was using. So let me go again. Just us two here. Let me just apply it. It's kind of harder to apply. Because it is a shimmer shadow. So you kind of have to work with it a little bit. But you'll get the pig bit payoff that you need. Okay, now I'm going to go in with Champagne on Ice. I'm flipping the brush. Just kind of adding that down here. We're bringing those together. Ooh, that was a lot of shimmer falling from there. Just the two of us. Oh, I don't ever say that. <laughs> I mean, I did say it, but you know. So now with a different brush here, this is a the Vintage Cosmetic Company. This is Step 3 Go Girl Go brush and we're going to go off with, we're going to go on with Rooftop View, which is this one, I don't know if you can see that, sorry. This one right here, it looks like it's a matte color but it's not, I promise. It's very a light glimmerness to it including the shadow so it just kind of brightens up the eye just a little bit so I'm just packing this in here and that's it now I'm gonna go back in with champagne on ice and just kind of layer that above it and just us two again into my inner corner or inner eyelid like so I'm going to be doing what is oh I'm gonna go back in with sandbar just a little bit and kind of fix this over here blend it out to make it look better blend it out smooth it out and with a, with sneak a kiss again the same thing just kind of blend into the pink Blend in the pink, I'm sorry, blend in the pink to the brown. I feel like I'm off center. I'm sorry if I am, I apologize for that, but yeah, that's that's that. Now I'm gonna go in with a um liner brush. I always forget what these are called for some reason. I'm gonna go with an uh, uh, I'm gonna go in with a liner brush and I'm gonna be using two shades here. I'm going to be using this deep purple plump shade. It's called Vineyard Escape. And then we're going to use this brown which is called Shady Spot. So those are the two we're using. We're going to create a semi wing. Nothing too drastic. Nothing too crazy. Just kind of give us a little dimension to the eye. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and guide it with one. Ooh, that was a lot. We made it too dark. It's okay. We'll go back and we'll blend. Okay, so now here. This is where we go on. Just the two of us. Sorry that I'm a bit too quiet. Like that. Do you see how semi sharp that wing looks? It looks so pretty, I love it. We're gonna be using some natural lashes for this makeup look today. So don't mind, okay? I'm gonna curl my lashes right now. No um, lighter is required for today. And I'm gonna use some very light lashes. I used these in my Spanish video. Um, these are the Ardell Wispies. And yeah. Just gonna go ahead and glue this on 
and I'll be back with my base on and to finish the eye look with you guys. Okay, so I'll be right back. Just give me one moment, please. Okay, queens, so we are back. Our eyes are officially done. Our face is done. We have bronzer, concealer, uh, foundation, powders, all that good stuff. All that good jazz. All of it on our eyelids. Our little, little, little eyeballs. So I'm going to go in with the same little uh, Luxie brush that we used with Sneak a Kiss to put the eyeshadow all over our eyelid. But I decided to go a little, just a little bit more deeper. So I'm going to go in with Private Villa, which is this one right here. See how it's just a bit deeper? That's the, that's the eyeshadow that we are going to be putting on our lower lash line. Okay, so let me go ahead and add this here. Mm. I like that. That's so cute. I forgot to bring out my um, mascara. But... Okay. Like so. Now with this brush, this is the one we used, uh, Rooftop View, we're going to go in with, I don't know what color to go in with, for the inner corner, I'm going to go in with Sunbathe. We're going to say screw it and we're going to go in with Sunbathe, which is this one right here. We're going to try that in our inner corner. So I'm going to flip the little brush and just kind of apply this. Oh, this looks a bit dark, but we're going to see. Um, I don't really think there was a difference. Well, kind of, yeah, kind of. Okay, I see it. All right, we're going to go ahead and apply it on the other eye, on the other inner corner. Yeah, you can see it. I just, it was just me. That's cute. This one has more though. That's really cute. Okay. So let me just go ahead and apply some bottom lash mascara real quick. I'm going to go in with my Milk Mascara. This is the Kush Waterproof Mascara by Milk Makeup. I haven't used this mascara in a while. We're just going to apply this to my bottom lashes. Perfect! So our bottom lash mascara is on. Now I am going to apply the lips. Our eyes are officially completed. We're going to go ahead and apply lips. I'm going to be using uh, my NYX lip, lip pencil. I'm going to go with my NYX lip pencil in brown. And I'm going to line these bad little babies. Okay, I'm gonna go in with my NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream. Uh, that's what it's called. Lipstick in Abu, Abu Dhabi. Abu Dhabi? Abu Dhabi? I don't know how to say that. Abu Dhabi. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna blend it in with my fingers real quick. I'm gonna go ahead and apply some lip gloss. This is the Maybelline Lifter Gloss in the color Pearl. And I'm just applying it to the center. <laughs> and that is it! That's all, you guys! I did it, I did it, I did it, yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is that butter gloss. I have the, that little, 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 
with that butter gloss lipstick I feel my lips just I could taste the gloss <laughs> without wanting to but yeah that is it this is a completed makeup look I decided to go in with the pinks on this Morphe 35s Oasis palette uh, sweet oasis sorry sweet oasis palette um the colors are very pretty i really really like them and i hope that you guys liked them as well and i hope you guys can create this it's pretty simple nothing too crazy but if you guys do have this palette go ahead and create this and show me tag me tag me on my instagram i will leave it down below in my description box and yeah that is it my queens i'm gonna stop rambling and say goodbye <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button, share, and subscribe to my channel. Leave me a comment down below letting me know what video ideas or what videos you guys would like to see on this channel. Also, don't forget to turn on your post notification bell icon to be notified every time I upload a new video. And that is it, my queens. I don't know what else to say except I will see you in my next video. Bye!